Yes, okay, this can be our game. Let's Finish. <gasps> we did, we finished our course C. So now we got another certificate. This is our third certificate because we did courses A, we got a certificate for that. We did courses B, we got a certificate for that. Now we're doing course C, we finished course C and we have a certificate for that too. So now you can put in your name and you can put in your name, I put in my name, click submit and it's gonna come up there. Assalamu alaikum dear viewers, welcome back to another episode of Coding with Fatiha here in Ruby Time Minute School and also in my page and channel. Today I am coming back right here into code.org. So I am I am in code.org and we will sign in and then we will continue our course C today. Okay, so continue lesson and what we're going to do is we're going to do the very last one since we did lesson number two in our um previous class so it says you're almost done collect as many pieces of treasure as you can to finish the stage okay so let's see what you can do first we have to go forward three times so let's use the repeat block so three times move forward isn't yeah that's correct so you have to move for or move forward three times then turn left oh move forward three times and then collect yeah so Move forward, collect, move forward, collect, move forward, collect. Then turn left. And then move forward and collect. Right? And then after collecting, you want to turn left again. And then use the repeat blocks, except this one, two times. Move forward and collect. Then you want to turn right. And then you want to move forward. And you want to collect that gem. So we're talking about this gem right here. And then after collecting that, you want to turn right again. Then you want to use the repeat blocks. And then you want to uh, repeat two times. And then move forward. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, move forward and collect. Okay, so we have to, there we go. Now let's see what it does. Move forward, move forward. Move forward, turn left, move forward, turn left, move forward, move forward. Turn right, turn right, move forward, and move forward. We just did it. Okay, so show code. And this is the JavaScript, inshallah. We will be doing that, but we'll focus on Blockly for now. Now we're going to do another, uh, an another sequence in here topic in uh, this course C, which is called binary. So there's this activity you can do, and then we're gonna start. Look closely at the code below. How many pumpkins will the farmer collect after you click run? Okay, so move forward, okay? Repeat four times pick pumpkin. But what I'm noticing here is that there's five pumpkins here. They're only picking four pumpkins because one, two, three, four. They're repeating four times. They actually should repeat five times. So that means that they won't collect all of the five. Okay, now. And then, okay, after cl clicking four, so we have four. Then move forward and then repeat four times again, pick pumpkin. So that's eight. Then you want to turn left move forward repeat four times pick pumpkin okay so then that means that four and then eight twelve because the rest of the code if you see it says that turn left okay you will turn left and then you move forward but it doesn't say they repeat uh this many times and then pick the pumpkin or else if it doesn't say pick the pumpkin the farmer will just be standing there and doing no work let's see what it does see create your own story when you're done click finish to share with friends see story ideas in the hints okay actually we're gonna create our own one let's see what there is okay there's a lot of from shoes from okay so let's see that let's say that there is an set actor one to a let's say dog okay and then set actor two i'm gonna create another actor to a 
um let's see we can do a unicorn maybe okay so actor one is a dog so actor two is a unicorn then when the okay so first show titles okay here here there is a con this is actually a message to the viewer who's doing who's actually play, who's actually running this story that i'm going to create this conversation is between a dog and a unicorn okay and a unicorn okay so in the title it's gonna say there's a conversation there is a conversation oh sorry there is a conversation between a dog and a unicorn okay and there's gonna be these actors then uh we're gonna what we're gonna do is that we're going to actor one say we can type whatever we want hi unicorn how are you doing how are you doing okay and then actor okay we're gonna wait wait for half second then actor two will say that oh there's no actor two we'll say that i'm great how are you i'm great you i'm great you um and then we're gonna wait for a half a second and like this you can create another and um a conversation so i'm gonna put one more quotation and then we're gonna do something else so it's gonna say i'm also great i am so happy to be talking with you again again okay so one oh okay so maybe this is uh, a little too long this is a conversation but we can write something else that a Converse conversation between a dog and a unicorn. See? And then Hi unicorn, how are you doing? Wait for half a second. I'm great. You? I'm also I'm also great. I'm so happy to be talking with you again. See? That's cool, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay so um what we're gonna for now it shows this what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna maybe it can't throw a basketball up and then when up clicked then move actor one up correct and then you, what you can do is that when actor so the ball okay actually i'm gonna set the another actor okay so actor three to be like a ball but there is no ball here so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna set it to a ghost that's so gonna be a squirrel maybe and then one actor let's say actor two sorry actor three touches actor two because when the squirrel touches the robot the ball touches the net then uh, we're gonna score a point then what we're gonna do is we're gonna vanish our actor two. Oh, not not our net sorry our vanish actor three our squirrel okay here one actor two no one actor one one actor one touches actor three then our um actor our actor Three should move down. Actor. Oh, sorry. Move our actor three down by, let's say, 30. 
Oh, okay, we have to do 50. Okay, now let's see what it does. <gasps> oh, we win! Yes! Okay, this can be our game. Let's Finish. <gasps> we did! We finished our course C. So, now we got another certificate. This is our third certificate because we did courses A. We got a certificate for that. We did courses B. We got a certificate for that. Now we're doing course C. We finished course C and we have a certificate for that too. So now you can put in your name and you can put in your name. I put in my name, click submit, and it's going to come up there. So this is our third one. Cool, right? And you can print this and download this too. So the, the next one is our course D. Inshallah, in our next class, we will move to course D. But thanks for watching. Assalamu alaikum.